Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to replace the aperture flux cable with a new one on a Sigma 12-24mm to 24 millimeter lens. Recently I had this lens with aperture problems. This was caused by a faulty flux cable, so I had to disassemble the lens, replace the flux cable with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to replace the flux cable. This video is part of video series about repairing the Sigma 12 to 24 mm lens. In the first video I show you how to disassemble the lens. In this second one I show you how to replace the flux cable. And the third one is about assembling the lens. If you're interested in them, then the links are here or down in the description below. First let me talk about the tools that I will use to replace the flux cable with a new one. I will use a PH30 screwdriver, a metal tweezers, a cutting pliers, a soldering gun, a soldering iron and a desoldering pump, and of course a new flux cable. If you are interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it, share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. The links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So, let's get started. Let's start with disassembling the aperture unit. Remove the three small screws. As can be seen, the flex cable is broken. Remove the screw from the cable holder. Remove the two smaller screws from the motor. Cut off the motor so the cable can be removed easier. Cut off the rest of the cable. Use the soldering pump to remove the soldering iron. Remove the remains of the flex cable. Remove the soldering iron from the connector of the motor, then remove the flex cable.
place the new flex cable to the motor. Solder the flex cable. Put back the motor to the aperture ring. Put back the two small screws. Stick the aperture cable to the wall. Put back the screw into the cable holder. Solder the cable to the aperture unit. Assemble the two parts of the aperture unit. Those two parts should be connected. Put back the three screws.
We are done with replacing the aperture flex cable. See you in my next video where I show you how to assemble the lens. You can find the links in the upper right hand corner or down in the description below. Thank you very much for watching my video. If you find that video useful, informative and adds value to you, then like it, share it, subscribe to my channel and consider donating. Links are in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. See you next time in another video.